a very happy morning guys today we shall see the oxidizing reactions of KM1O4 in neutral and alkaline solutions uh, basically already we have seen the oxidizing reaction of KM1O4 in acid medium period already done now we can see the balancing of ionic equation basically before entering the topic I will give you a few points to balance the ionic equation in basic medium Point number one, first balance the oxidation number, oxidation number. So balance oxidation number means we have to maintain the number of electron transfer equal in both the sets. That is number of electrons must be equal on both the sides right number of electrons must be equal on both the sides next uh, balance all atoms other than hydrogen or the oxygen other than hydrogen and oxygen and next step for balanced oxygen for balancing oxygen add OH minus right and then for balancing hydrogen add H2 right? we have to add H2 and remember most importantly when we are adding H2O we are not adding the hydrogen alone as well as an oxygen is also there so the number of OH minus ions equal to the number of hydrogen should be added on the opposite side right? if you are adding 5H2O on LHS you have to add 5OH minus on right hand side on the RHS right? if you are adding 5H2O in LHS if you have to add 5OH minus ion on RHS in order to balance the number of hydrogen atoms right so these are the steps we have to follow let us get into the topic now let us consider this equation that is M1O4 minus plus I minus gives MNO2 plus IO3 minus right so here the oxidation state of M1 is plus 7 here in M1 O2 the oxidation state of M1 is plus 4 right so what happened it has gone from plus, plus 7 to plus 4 so the difference in the electron is 3 so 3 electrons are involved here and this is a reduction reaction decrease in oxidation number so this is a reduction reaction right here I minus here the iodine is in minus one oxidation state. Here in IO3 iode 8 ion it is in plus 5 oxidation state. So minus 1 to plus 5 oxidation state. What happens at the oxidation number increases so that it is called as oxidation reaction and the number of electrons involved is 6 electrons. Right? So first of all we have to balance the number of electrons so that we can multiply this equation into 2. So let us consider this as a first equation. So the first equation shall be multiplied by 2 in order to balance electrons, uh, in order to balance electrons and shall be written as 2M1O4 minus plus I minus gives 2M1O2 plus IO3 minus right and what is the thing here first we have to balance the oxidation number and we have to balance the number of electron on both sides that has been done right by multiplying with simple numbers next balance all atoms other than hydrogen and oxygen let us check here apart from hydrogen and oxygen what are the atoms here M1 M1 iodine iodine so 2m1, 2m1 and 1 iodine, 1 iodine. So this part is already done. That is 
all the atoms other than hydrogen and oxygen are already balanced so then we can go for balancing of oxygen third point balancing of oxygen what we have to we have to add oh minus right so here how many oxygen are here 2 into 4 8 oxygen are here and here 2 into 2 4 oxygen and here 3 oxygen so 4 plus 3 total is 7 oxygen so i'm adding one more oh minus ion to compensate the number of oxygen right and next point now we have to think about the hydrogen so in order to add the hydrogen compensate the hydrogen we have to add h2o and along with hydrogen we are adding oxygen so that where we are adding the h2o in opposite side we have to add the same number of oh minus ions right okay now let me count the number of hydrogen here let me count the number of hydrogen here so here there is only one hydrogen so that i am adding that is 2MnO4 minus plus I minus plus 1 hydrogen. 2, 1 hydrogen, for that I am adding 1 water molecule. That gives 2MnO2 plus IO3 plus, so already there is a OH, I already told you, to balance the number of hydrogen atoms, you are not only adding the H plus ion, you are adding the oxygen too. So, then uh, how many number of uh, water molecules we are adding here? Exact number of OH also should be added here. So I had added one water molecule here. So I am adding one more water molecule there. So already there is one OH minus ion. So I am adding one more. It will become two OH minus ion. Right? It will become two OH minus ion. That's it. Now it has been balanced. Let us check it out. So this is the final balanced equation. That is, I am writing one more time. 2MnO4 minus plus I minus plus H2O gives 2MnO2 MnO2 plus IO3 minus IO3 minus plus 2OH minus. Right? So this is the final balanced equation. This is the final balanced equation given in your book. So let me check your book. Right. Here. Yeah. This is the reaction we are working about. This is the reaction we are working about. That is 2MO4 plus H2O plus I minus. 2MO4 plus H2O plus I minus gives 2MO2 plus 2OH minus plus IO3. 2MO2 plus 2OH minus, minus plus IO3. So this is the final equation. Right, let me show you the question of this reaction. Balance the following redox reaction the basic medium. So this uh, this is the thing will be given to you. So this is the equation will be given to you and you have to choose a right equation for this. So what equation we have worked out here? 2 m one over plus i minus h2, this is the right equation. So this is the right option for you. And right? this is the right option for you.